Hey there, and welcome to A Budgeting Mama. My name is Christy. I am a military spouse and a stay-at-home mom of four kids. And here on my channel, I share our budgeting journey, our cash budgeting journey to becoming financially free. So in today's video, we're going to be doing a cash stuffing of sinking funds and savings challenges. Um, I already did my cash envelopes in a previous video. If you haven't already watched it, definitely go check it out. I'll put it up here in the cards. If you are new to my channel, welcome. I'm super excited to have you here. It's become a part of my community. If you go ahead and hit that subscribe button, you will be officially a part of the family. And I would absolutely love that. Also, don't forget to hit that notification bell so you can be notified every time I upload a video, which is right now about every Wednesday and every Friday. Um, that's what I try to stick to. So definitely look out for my next video the next Wednesday. So um, yeah, I already have my tracker pulled up. We're gonna go ahead and hop into our sinking funds. So if you guys watch my um, budget with me video, um, it's gonna be a little bit different. There were a couple uh, bills that were unexpected. And so I had to, you know, reduce the amount of money that I'm stuffing and that is okay, it happens. Um, a couple of funds we are actually starting over on. Um, so I will let you guys know what those are as we go through. But a couple items that you might have seen in my previous budgeting video that I said we were gonna stuff, we're not stuffing this time. It happens. So the amount we are actually gonna be stuffing today is $248. So I'm gonna go ahead and get myself situated here and we'll get started. All right, I'm just gonna move my computer over here to the side. we make this a little bit bigger so you guys can see it. Um, I do have this PDF in my Etsy shop. It is linked down below. I actually had someone buy it. This is my very first Etsy sale. I'm super excited about it. Um, I know it was very small, but it was still really exciting. So um, definitely go check that out if you guys are interested. Um, all right, let's go ahead and count our money. So we have 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. 20, 40, 60, 80, 200, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40. And we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 dollars. 248 dollars that we'll be stuffing in our sinking funds and um, savings challenges today. I do have a new uh, savings challenge because I finished my Valentine's savings challenge, which it actually came in handy because um, I guess I mentioned this in a video as well, but we were gifting, like doing a gift exchange for our neighbors. And so I'm so glad we had that extra Valentine's Day money. Um, so I did, I ended up using my holiday sinking funds on my kids and, um, the actual Valentine's Day challenge money, I used that to get the gifts for our neighbors. Um, so that was that was cool. Uh, so first we're gonna go ahead and, and put our change into our change jar. I had a lot more change, but um, <laughs> I went to go pick up some food for takeout one day and all I had was this and then some cash in my wallet. And for some reason, I thought I had my debit card because um, I had a specific amount of money on my debit card to use for takeout because it's super fast. Right? I could just easily hand over the card, um, but I didn't. And I had just enough like dollars and change to pay for the meal because I didn't go prepared to use cash. And so luckily I had some change. But anyways, so I would have had a lot more change but I ended up using it that day. All right, so that is all our change emptied out. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and start with my pink binder and start stuffing. So I hope you guys are having a fabulous day. Um, today has been um, pretty, pretty chill. Uh, I'm trying to get myself into a routine of doing things. Um, it's kind of hard to do so, but uh, getting out of the habit of uh, 
I guess like using excuses as to why I can't do certain things. Like, so I'm trying my best to um, create new habits. And one of those is having a routine throughout the day, especially for my youngest, um, she's 18 months old. And I feel like sometimes we don't really have a you know, structured routine for her. And we're gonna be soon putting her into daycare. And so um, when I go back to school, and so I kind of just want to start working with her, getting a little bit more of a routine um, so that when she does go into a you know, daycare setting, she's kind of used to having routine and structure a little bit more. So that is one of my goals. Um, I would, if you guys have any goals, drop them down below. I'd love to hear them. All right, let's get into stuffing, guys, because I will talk all day. Okay, so we are stuffing our buffer. $20. This is one of the ones that we have used. As you can see, it's empty. So we're starting fresh on our buffer, building that back up a little bit for emergencies as we need. Um, car maintenance is going to get $10. So five, $10 is going into car. Car has $40 already. So we'll have 20, 40, 45, $50 into car maintenance. Um, my goal right now is $75 um, for car maintenance because my husband needs to get a diagnostic done on his car and it costs $75 to get it. So, well, almost there, almost there. Okay, so we're not stuffing anything else until we get to medical, which is right here. So we are stuffing $10 into medical. All right, so we now have five, 10, 15, 20, $25 into medical. Okay, so that's pretty much enough for like one copay. <laughs> one person's copay. All right, and then school is getting $10. So I'm actually gonna start getting the ball rolling on this one because at first I was gonna be using this for my kids only, but now since I'm going back to school, I'm gonna need to start setting aside some funds. So I need to get a plan together for this envelope. Um, five, 10. So this envelope now has five, 10, 15, 16, 17 dollars. So yeah, I gotta get the ball rolling on that. Uh, I am planning to start classes in May. Um, I actually had a meeting with my advisor yesterday and um, I'm really excited, guys. I'm super excited. All right, so we're not stuffing anniversary. All right, so we're going down here um, to our important savings goals. So we have Hubby is getting $20 into his. All right, so he now has 20, 40, 60 dollars in here. And savings is getting 25 dollars. All right, so we now have 20, 45 dollars into savings. And then moving, this is a new envelope. I just added this envelope. Um, we are prepping for moving, so gotta start saving up and it's getting $20 in here. 20 going into moving. And I have one month ahead added as well as a new envelope so we can get ahead on our bills. Um, I don't have a label for that one yet, but this is where this one will be housed so we have twenty dollars going into one month ahead and that is everything for our pink binder so we're gonna move on to my black binder okay so each of the kids always gets twenty dollars that's what they all get into their savings um, they're all, I started them all at the same time. So they all have $40 and now we'll have $60. So go ahead and do that for all of theirs.
Okay, $60 in all of the kids. All right, so we're down here. So we're not doing any holidays, sports, any of these actually. All right, so we're gonna put $3 into, let's see, clothes. Clothes is getting $3. $3 is going into clothes. All right, and retirement is getting $20. Retirement only has 20 right now, so now it has $40 in retirement. All right, and so now we can go on to our challenges. So um, we have our 52 week challenge. So we are on week five, and that means we have, um, five dollars to add into that so five dollars all right and then have a five dollars here one two three four five and i'm going to be adding this into my five dollar challenge I'm actually going to swap these out really quickly because this just because i'm being weird and these are bills <laughs> i'm gonna just switch these out okay All right, and then I'm gonna put $5 into this challenge here. All right, so I'm gonna pick up five. And um, if you guys are new to my channel, this $5 savings challenge is for $500. So my goal is to get <laughs> better at this. I need to, um, you know, try not to spend so much money. Ah, so hard. When you got kids, guys, it's super hard not to. Okay, five dollars. But it's better than nothing. I don't want my batteries dying. But it's okay because we're done. So it's right on time. Five dollars is going in. Now I do have another challenge that I wanted to do, but I'm not able to do it. It's our look my luxury bag challenge. Um, and the bag that I want is not an actual luxury bag. It is just um, a bag that I wanna use for school. It's super cute and it has a lot of space and it also has like a compartment that you can use for like lunch to put your food in. And so um, I did create a challenge here. I'll show you guys the challenge I created. The savings challenge is just, um, it's $450. The bag itself is not $150. I think it's $120. But um, it's, so I just put it on here $10. So every time I save $10, add those up. And then this is enough that will allow me to save $150 to go towards the bag. So I can't do it this time, but hopefully next time I'll be able to, to start it. So that is that. All right, so we're done, guys. We've stuffed the savings challenges and sinking ones that we could do this particular time. Um, and I hope that you guys, especially like I know a lot of people in the groups are that I'm in, you know, mention things like um, not having enough to put into sinking funds. And look, guys, this is real life. Like you can't always fill up every single envelope you have. Like um, I admit, in the beginning, I wanted to always fill up all my envelopes, but is sometimes not possible. So you prioritize which ones are most important to you and you focus on those in that particular time. Um, so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this real holistic, real life stuffing. Um, and I hope you guys enjoyed it enough to give me a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. All right, guys, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.